Hey, Guitar Bass, it's your girl, Britt Brat, going live with the Breed Talk. And y'all, we're going to talk about Armand Wiggins from the Armand Wiggins show and his monkey comments. Ciao. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Let's go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not facts. I would like to take this time to shout out our pay for sponsors, Amazon. By shopping using the link I have pinned down below in the comments, baby, you can shop until you're dropping. If you're an Amazon Prime member, you get next day shipping. Who doesn't like that? So let's get into the mess. So this is on his Twitter. I don't know if it's still up, but it says, if everyone unsubscribed today and I love YouTube, some things would still remain. So hate me all you want. Hashtag the Black Howie. Y'all do realize canceling me doesn't change the way you look or perceive yourself. And for the struggle channels, you do realize you'll have to actually put in work for content. Wow, this nigga really lost his mind. So we just heard the tweets. I will say this, I don't feel I'm unattractive. I don't feel I'm uh. I feel like I'm pretty. I don't feel like I wasn't <laughs> around pretty girls or I was in the, uh, what do you call, not the in crowd. <laughs> that is so high school, by the way, as adults. But I will say this. Calling a woman a monkey is colorist, racist. It speaks volumes. Armand, you're wrong. And if you felt if you felt like you were right, you would have kept up your video. You would have kept the comments on. You know you're wrong. That's why you're just sitting there. You went on Twitter and did a whole rant and was like, I'm like the Howard Stern. Baby, Howard Stern don't turn off the comments. And by the way, nobody respects Howard Stern. And when I say nobody, nobody. Literally nobody, okay? You were wrong. Instead of identifying that Evelyn pointing out how she's depicted as a racist and a colorist, which you didn't have to because it's your channel, you decided to say, I feel like OG looks like a monkey. Come on, guys, we need to stop it. If you think she's ugly, that's one thing, but a monkey, a monkey. A monkey, really? Like, A monkey. And that's why people were like, well, Evelyn, what did you mean by she's ugly? What about her is ugly? And that's why she brought up Chad. Now, was that the best lighting and saying that? No, but when you're reading somebody, hit them where it hurts. Now, I'm not gonna ever, as black people, we don't call people monkeys. We just don't. I need us to stop doing that. And then Jason Lee coming up with this race and colorism thing, they're not synopsis. Race is a social construct. Colorism was definitely implemented through the Willie Lynch system so that way it could keep the black people down. If you read it, you would know. <laughs> that, that's how I know the people who were just like, yeah, if you felt some type of way, you're ugly. What? This black man, this black man, physically, visually black, called another black woman a monkey and sided with his oppressor. If that ain't the most coon shit I've ever seen in my life, cooning at an all time high. That's why I said, nope, I have to unsubscribe because the ignorance was volumes. And instead of just saying, I'm sorry, I apologize, I didn't mean it that way, even if you didn't, because you caught yourself in the live, the li and he still has it up, saying, I'm, I'm, I might be putting my foot in my mouth. That was the moment you should have shut up, okay? Like, I, I, I just don't understand. Make it make sense. Uh, and then you're talking about, I only like bad bitches. Well, you like poor hoes, because Evelyn is as broke as they come. If you take their child support away, sis would fall the hell out. Like, I get it, she's aesthetically pleasing to you, fine. But to sit there and say, but OG is a monkey, what? Do you not know your history, brother? That is what they put on us, white supremacists, put on the black society when the slaves were free during the Jim Crow era to keep us oppressed, to keep 
other races, the white race, in fear of us. If we look like a monkey and act like a monkey when they shoot us dead down in the streets, y'all can come up with a million and ten excuses. Well, he should have put his hands up. He shouldn't have had a hoodie. Why did he talk back? Etc. 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 That's all I'm saying. I can tell y'all moms didn't turn on PBS at all. Like, what the hell was y'all watching? Clearly, it wasn't reading Rainbow. Y'all must have been watching Ratchet TV, Bad Girls Club all your life because it doesn't make sense and you're just like, what a bad bitch to you is a bitch who has to suck and fuck for some Gucci, which there's nothing wrong with that. If that's how you're getting your money, sis, get it how you live. Just make sure you get some O's in your account. Have something to show for it because all, the only thing Evelyn has to show is them tired ass 2012 butterfly earrings. I don't like it. I'm not about to let anybody just come up into our space of blackness and, and steal. They done done enough of that. Like, I'm over it. I'm sick and tired of the pandering. You got the the fat Joes out here. Well, we're more black than the blacks. And then you got Remy Ma. Like, Miss, oh Lord. She might as well be up there with Kanye. And I was like, see, this is why I never liked you. I always knew it was something, because you're dumb. Talking about, well, his mama and them can make collard greens and macaroni and cheese. If y'all don't shut up there shucking and jiving, like, girl, no, no. When I look at Fat Joe, I see Indian, uh, a mestizo look like J-Lo. And Erica Mena. And Cincentana. And Evelyn Lozada. And Cardi B. I don't, y'all love to bring up this, but the texture of the hair, like white people don't have that texture. It might not be as coarse, but their hair gets thick, thick, and very cur tight curl too. Like, let's stop it. Let's stop it. Like, I, I'm, no. Everybody can't come up in here and sip the Kool Aid and think they can profit when it's beneficial to them. And they say nothing to help build or empower us. I'm over it. Armand, you're wrong. You, instead of just saying, I'm sorry, you took the weakest approach ever. Let me delete my video and disable the comments and block anybody who has some sense who's not standing up for the BS. But anyways, those are my thoughts. Those are my opinions. Comment down below and I gotta go. Bye. I was rooting for you. We were all rooting for you. How dare you?